Today I'm going to be talking about how to tell if a girl is lying. Because honestly, like, girls were, like, we're fucking liars. Like, we're horrible. She devils were the worst. We're not, but lots of men on the internet like to think that. You know what? Sometimes we lie about things. Everybody lies, but I feel like, to be completely honest, I feel like girls are worse liars than guys. And I used to think it was the opposite, because I used to think girls were, like, more conniving. And I think that we are. I think we try to be better liars, but I don't think we are. We have a few telltale things that not every girl does, but I think on average, these are good ways to tell if your girl's lying to you. Now this doesn't necessarily have to be in a relationship. This doesn't have to be about cheating or anything like that. This could be just like a friend. It could be your mom. Your mom's a goddamn liar, honestly. So anyways, without further ado, here are ways to tell that a girl is lying to you. Also, if you like these types of videos, how to tell, relationship, girl, boy-ish, in the mind of the psyche, and these types of videos that I do, leave a like on this video. Let's get it to 2,500 likes. Also, if we get 2,500 likes, then in a few weeks, I will be doing the spin-off to this video, which is things that girls lie about. Because there are definitely specific things that all girls have lied about, especially to guys. So if you want to see that video, leave a like. Also, subscribe around here if you're new. I upload every Monday and Friday. Without further ado, here is how to tell a girl's lying. The first way to tell is if she laughs a lot. And this doesn't go for every girl, but a lot of girls have this problem. I'm definitely one of them. Where we just, I smile and I laugh when I'm nervous. And usually when you're, you know, when you're lying to someone, you're nervous. For example, if a guy comes up to me and he asks if I have a boyfriend, my first instinct is obviously going to be to say yes, even if I don't, because I don't want you to talk to me. But I'm gonna do it in a really awful way that you can tell I'm lying. And it's gonna hurt your feelings, but I don't mean to. It's just that if you're like, hey baby, you want to get your number? I'm most likely gonna be like, um, uh, <laughs> I, um, yeah, actually, I'm, I'm a boyfriend. Which really is just the fucking worst. The second way to tell if a girl's lying is if she tries to turn you on, or flirts with you, or uses the boobies. A lot of times if you're dating a girl and she gets caught in a little white lie, she's probably going to try to turn you on because to be completely honest, guys are easy with that. You know what I mean? It's like, hey, like, were you texting your ex-boyfriend? Look what I got. It's gonna work. You're men. You have penises that you use to think with. All I'm saying is, if you're asking a girl about a lie that she possibly told, and she, you know, starts the conversation by being like, well, you know, it's a funny story, actually, because what happened was, I'm not exactly this in the morning, babe? She wants play, Tor. She's going to bed. She's lying. She's lying. She's trying to get your mind off of it so you don't remember for like a week, and then by the time you bring it up, she's got a rock solid excuse, and all of the texts are deleted. Another thing she might do is try to turn on you. This seems to be a really, really good way to get out of something, or to, you know, lie, or to get out of something. I okay, I look that different. But the truth is, if somebody does this to you, it's usually a pretty, pretty. Why? Okay, can I just not? Okay, um, I'm just gonna shut the fuck up and, and end the fucking video. If someone tries to turn the situation on you during an argument or when you are asking them about a possible lie, it's usually pretty obvious that they are trying to turn it on you for a specific reason and that's because they're lying. And even though I tried really hard to get through that sentence, it still didn't really make any fucking sense and I'm pretty sure that I scratched my crotch in the middle of it. So what are, what is this? Look, just tell me the truth. My boy saw you out with those guys last night. Okay, well, on July 27th at 2.05 p.m., you were texting this bitch, so who the fuck is that? The fourth one is they'll try to make you look crazy. This one actually usually works pretty well because when somebody's told that they're acting crazy, they usually back off and they try to look at it from any way that's gonna make them not look crazy. Personally, this one's my favorite. I'm kidding. I feel like this is the most popular one. Guys, girls, Dogs, everybody use this this one. Dogs actually do use this because if you come home and there's pee somewhere and then you're like, excuse me, Roger, what the fuck is that over there? Really honest dogs are gonna be like, <sighs> but then there are always the asshole dogs or the cats who are just like, 
Okay, obviously that was you. Hey Judy, I know you guys are kind of crazy, but I think I saw you throw away my lunch earlier and uh, it wasn't really yours to throw away. Okay, John, like you, okay, you need to take a step back, you need to calm down, really think about what you're asking me. Like, really think about it. Does it sound insane? Like, what logical reason could I possibly have for throwing away your sandwich? Honestly, what possible logical reason? You know what? You're so right. I'm sorry. That motherfucker for writing me up last week. And the last way to tell if a girl is lying is if she poops all over the place. Okay, uh, actually, that one's just me. I don't poop all over the place, but like I definitely poop. So I have this weird habit where every time that I have anxiety or I get anxious or I get nervous, instantly have to poop every single time, like clockwork. It's kind of weird actually, it's kind of crazy. I don't know like why it happens, but it's a, it's a thing. Like it's an actual thing that happens and I can't stop it. It's the weirdest fucking thing. So if you are like, you know, if it's me, or if it's somebody like me, and you're like, hey, what were you doing last night? And they're like, I have to go take a shit. They're, they're lying, maybe. Maybe they have to take a shit. But like, if it's me, but, wow, I'm really like a wonderful woman. Honestly, like, I'm so really like great. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this Ways to Tell If a Girl Is Lying. Like I said, if you want to see types of lies girls tell, don't forget to get to 2,500 likes. Subscribe around here if you're new, and I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, bye. Cassie wins. Fatality. Take you away, let's escape into the night.